Hey guys, it's the Solo Cloth here today, and so this monster analysis video, we're going to be going over Max Shroom, and I'm going to be telling you guys why you should get him out of his current breeding event. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so Max Shroom is a tank, and his traits are going to be Control Immunity, which is amazing, and then Poison Immunity, which is his only bad one, and then Rank 3 Status Caster Taunt, which is probably his best trait. So yeah, in order to use this monster, you will want to get him to Rank 3, because Taunt is very good for tanks, obviously. And then his relics are Armor and Armor, which are both good for tanks. And now let's go on down to his pros and cons. So he has decent trait, he's got nice forms of Sustain in Double Life, Healing, Regen, and Damage Mirror, which are all great for tanks. He also has the second highest life stat in the Abyssal Era, which doesn't really matter. He also has good relic slots for a tank. And he has access to poison and toxins for tortures, which are both great. And his cons are taunt is just an effect, which is true, so it can be removed. It is a status caster. And then a weak to reverse healing. Taunt is bypassed by pierce and cold blood and bad speed. So his weak to reverse healing is kind of not really a problem. Not many monsters use reverse healing nowadays, so that doesn't really matter but taunt is bypassed by pierce and cold blood that is a problem but that's just his counters and then he has bad speed which isn't really a problem for a tank honestly now let's go on down to his move set so he does have a 50 percent damage mirror with self taunt which is pretty good he also has an aoe of poison and toxins which is really good he has a self double life with a 30 percent heal which is really great and then he also has another damage mirror with 30 percent heal or a 10 percent heal with zero cooldown but i would definitely go with the damage mirror so he has some pretty great tanking moves right there the damage mirrors are amazing and you have multiple of them that you can put on so that when one is cooling down you can put on the other if you get hit and then he also has the poison and toxins to just chip away at the enemies which is great and then he also has the self double life with heal and of course the uh, double life will make the damage mirror give you even more health and it also heals to help you not die which is really great so yeah he's got some really great tanking moves if you can get a support with like negative effect removal or something that will make him really good and yeah that's pretty much all i have to say about max stream definitely get him out of the current breeding event he is completely free right now so yeah just go ahead and get him he's very easy to get and i'll see you guys in the next one over to like share and subscribe goodbye